everyone and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. Guys, I have tried to restart this reading now twice, okay? Um, and this is as far as I got, right here. <laughs> and I had to stop because it's retrograde time for me and I'm having a really hard time talking. I don't know what the deal is, but I'm like laughing at myself. So I have to restart. I seriously haven't even moved my fingers where I was here and we just got started. This reading, it's a random collective reading, okay? Um, it's It may or may not resonate with you. It's not going to be for all of you. Um, so just take what does resonate, toss out the rest, okay? <laughs> and thank you to everyone for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything across the board. Thank you so much. Um, for everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Honestly, I'm laughing because usually I wouldn't have like restarted it, but the way my words were all like, blah, 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 it came out so bad and I, it, it was actually really funny. So anyway, take two guys. Okay. Um, overall energy is this. All right. I feel like it's kind of um, <laughs> contradictive, I feel. Um, you, are, you made it through this whole big journey, carrying a big wish with you the whole time. Now, it's been a solo dolo journey. I don't see anyone here next to you. But if you notice, you're not centered in the card. You're off to the side. And I feel like that wish is waiting for this person to be here joining you, like someone else should be here next to you. That's the feeling that I'm getting, just where you're standing in this card. And I feel like that's been a wish that you've taken with you through this journey. Um, it At times it may have even um, made you feel stronger, you know, or made you find your strength through this journey, okay? But here you are standing here alone, ready. You're right on the cusp of being able to manifest whatever you want. This is the portal to the new cycle here. And you've made it. You're right on the edge. All you have to do is walk into your new cycle, but you're going to have to let go of that balloon, right? Um, and you're hoping that whoever you're, it's almost like you've made space here for someone else to be at your side when you walk into that portal, okay? Now at the same time though, you're, you're also protecting yourself. You also have your boundaries up. So there's something about this wish that you, you're not comfortable with, that you are worried about, that you feel you have to protect yourself from. It's really kind of an odd feeling. It's like you wish somebody was standing here next to you, but yet at the same time you feel like you need to protect yourself in this bubble. Okay, so it's kind of, I don't know who that's hitting home with, but that's what I got. Um, that's really what I'm feeling like here. Okay. Yeah, so I feel like, um, I feel like you're getting prepared to go it alone. All right, still kind of hanging on to that wish. I'm feeling a little bit of a sadness here, but yet you've got this bubble up around you. What you don't know is something is coming towards you. Expect the unexpected. Okay, this was actually your first card out. Um, I feel like you're, you're going to be joined with somebody here. Something unexpected is coming. Um, and it's going to, it's going to, you're going to once again be standing here looking in through a doorway, looking into a portal. Like, do you want this? Do you not want this? Is this what you want? Right? You may even have like a vision of how it's going to be. All right, um, so you kind of, uh, something unex unexpected comes in. I feel like your bubble takes over, right? <laughs> your protective bubble, and you kind of stand here again, looking at what it could be like, trying to use your discernment here, um, using your intuition, because your, your, your sight is clouded. You really don't, 
you don't know for a fact that it's going to be good or bad. You're just standing here kind of, this is a decision that you have to make, is what I'm feeling. That once this something unexpected comes in, you're going to need to make a decision using your discernment and your intuition. Something that you want maybe really, really bad. Something you've carried with you, a dream, a wish, a hope on this journey okay that's what i'm seeing this as so you've been you've stepped you've made space for someone to be standing here next to you in the middle of the page do you see that but yet you're guarded right you're really guarded you got your boundaries up i don't want to be hurt again you know what i mean um, I feel like there's there's a flower here, though, that's bouncing off of this. Just know maybe um, not to be so guarded that you miss opportunities, okay? Don't be so guarded that you actually miss the good stuff because this might actually be something that's really good. I'm seeing a doorway opening here into everything blossoming, blooming, um, it's warm, coming coming out of the cold, right? Um, yeah, but you're you're using your intuition. Is this going to hurt me or not? This is what I've been wishing for, but is this going to hurt me or not? I'm going to keep my boundaries up, right? That's kind of what I'm seeing. I feel like something. This is unexpected for you. I feel like because this situation and everyone involved has kind of been in the dark right? Your, your vision has been clouded. You, you've been in the dark, and I feel like this person's been in a dark space too. Um, but now somebody is about to take some kind of action, okay? And I feel like it's your masculine, um, since it, he's out here, right? I really feel like they're trying to possibly communicate with you. I know they're getting signs, synchronicities, downloads, messages um, from the divine, and I feel like here in the background, there's two people holding hands. They're doing nothing but like being nostalgic about you, um, thinking about you. They're doing the same thing, thinking about how it could be. I feel like somebody's approaching you. Um, it's going to be completely unexpected. Um, it may kind of like make you wobble for a second while you think about this. And this is going to give you something to think about. I feel like this person's going to be approaching you here and um, coming towards you. I feel like this is, you know, this is a new beginning, right? You've got a new beginning here, a brand new doorway that opens up. I feel like um, you really need to take a moment process the information, definitely use your intuition and discernment, but um, I feel like you're going to want to take a moment to, to process everything, okay, if that makes sense, because I think a, a, a wish is about to appear for you un unexpectedly, and I feel like it's this masculine energy, I've got to say, all right, what messages do you have for the person watching just use your intuition and your discernment for everyone who approaches you make sure you ask the right questions you know um, and look for the red flags look for the red flags and don't um, don't ignore them you know somebody's dropping the burdens in this feel like they're dropping the burdens. Yeah, they're coming towards you, their empress. I feel like this person's very passionate about it. Um, I'm feeling the energy is quite intense. This is somebody who's been trying to make a decision between two, I feel, okay? Getting downloads, messages. Um, they've been in the dark. Look at all the darkness around them. Uh, but now things are starting to sink into their melon, too. And I, I really feel like they're coming out of the dark and getting ready to take action. Look, they're coming out of the dark and they're getting ready to take action. I feel like they do have some fear here because they don't really know what's going to happen. They don't know what to expect. 
you haven't been talking to this person. You've been working on um, creating something for yourself, okay? But, uh, yeah, this person's about to make a decision and come forward and take some action. I don't, they're, they're dropping the burdens here. They've been carrying this burden around for them for a really long time. You know, being stuck in the crossroads here. But uh, I see them dropping those burdens. They want their empress. They want their empress. Um, wanting this passionate new beginning. And that would be you, person watching. I feel like you're their empress here. Very abundant. Um, very intuitive. Uh, very high vibing. Connected to the divine. You, you have the attributes of every queen in the deck because you've earned that knowledge um, on this journey. Okay? Uh, pretty much one phase at a time. But you, you're now seated at the empress throne here. Um, and I feel like you're out here handling everything pretty much on your own uh, with the help of the divine, right? I feel like you're being led. You've been led. You've got this portal here. You're starting a new cycle. And, uh, yeah, you're sitting pretty. Very strong power here. And this person, they know who it is that they want. See, I'm seeing these as two wands, right? They needed to choose between two. They can only start a journey with the one, right? So, um, so yeah, I feel like they've chosen. And here, they're handing it to you. Yeah, look. New cycle. New beginnings, right? We've got portals here. If there's a portal, there's a portal. Doorways opening for you. Um, this is completely unexpected, Completely unexpected that this person is coming in, but I'm telling you, it's time. Yeah, it's time. They're coming in to tell you the truth. Be honest with you. They're flying, and this is gonna this is gonna come at you from the side. I'm telling you, but they see you as literally like everything. Um, you are balanced, strong, confident. You've been through the last cycle. You learned what you had to learn from it. It was painful. It was tough. But those lessons really sunk in. It's put you in the Empress throne. And now you're entering into a cycle that's going to be super abundant. Like I said, it's blossoming here, blooming, right? All lies on you. You could be in the public eye, but the universe has seen the effort that you put into yourself because you don't get to the Empress status unless you've been dragged through hell, dragged through dirt, gravel, skinned up knees, pain, blood, sweat, and tears. I mean, so much effort was put into yourself. The universe has seen it. And now you're stepping into abundance. Um, very intuitive, being divinely led. Yeah, your person, I feel like this is their energy. Um, they know it too. They're, they've been feeling stuck but they're becoming enlightened as well. It's like you guys are starting to align here. And now they're enlightened. They're, they want to come in. They want to open up, tell you the truth. Um, it's just time. The divine says, do, 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 do. It's time for all of the secrets to come out. It's time for everyone to open up about their feelings, show themselves, you know, be who they are and be honest about it. Okay, um, yeah, what was done in the light is now coming, or what was done in the dark is now coming to light, that kind of thing. But I'm just seeing this as it's, it's time for you guys to start aligning with each other. And I think you are right now. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. This person has waited so long. That's why you've been on this solo journey alone, okay? They've waited so long to come, come towards you. They've always known that they have the passion for you. That one that they're hanging on to there, that's this one. But like I said, they were, they were needing to make a decision of which path to take. Hold on, my phone's ringing. Okay, sorry about that person watching. I don't, I don't take calls when I'm giving readings, okay? Um, so anyway, uh, yeah, I feel like um, 
they were in the, in a crossroads, right? Needing to choose a path, but they, they put it off. They waited too long. Um, they're probably wondering right now, is all the emotion gone? Because all of the water's dried up here. This person could have been waiting for um, the perfect opportunity, or they were waiting for some kind of ships to come in, but they've waited too long. The portal is here. Will they have time, right? I feel like this is happening. They're coming in. Expect the unexpected. Clarify this page of wands. Got the page of wands out here. This is communication, but it's immature communication. Yeah, this person, they haven't told you how they feel about you. They haven't told you, they haven't shown you, they were very immature when it came to showing you love and, and emotions. Give me one more on this one. I feel like now they really want to invest into you, but they've been putting their time and effort into something else, but I see them dropping the burdens on that. They're dropping burdens here. Yeah, they were connected to devil energy here, giving up. Well, investing pretty much everything, okay? They were investing everything, energy, time, money, you know, what you would normally invest in a, in a relationship, right? They were investing with, in something toxic, I feel. And it's cost them a lot. They were providing for someone. It, was, it could have been all about money. Yeah, and now they're regretful because there wasn't any love in those cups. Whatever they chose over you in a third party here, there were no there was no love there. It was just about money. Okay, and they know this now. All of the cups are knocked over. They can clearly see there's no blood or there's no love there, just blood and sand, right? And they turn their back on the wrong person. They turn their back on this empress here, in, <laughs> who is being absolutely stunningly amazing, by the way. And they can see that because everyone can see that. You're in the public eye somehow, whether you're posting your, your pictures out there or, um, or doing something, maybe even online, doing something intuitive. You're wrapped in intuition here. Um, being spiritually led definitely i feel like in order to get to the empress throne you have to be spiritually led because the empress goes through such a like it's it's an excruciating and difficult journey to get here okay and you've got to have the divine with you in order to get through that that's how i kind of feel there and I, and the 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 universe has seen all of it and so is this person. They've seen everything. You're changed. You've changed. And you're out here being stunning, sexy, beautiful on top of it. You could be like a, um, a mother here too. But I'm just seeing this as, you know, you're, you're amazing. <laughs> basically, basically, yeah. Strong, powerful, intuitive, amazing. Um, and this person knows they turn their back on the wrong on the wrong person. They know all of this is going to come out. Um, why? Because it's time. It's the beginning of a new cycle, and um, I feel like the divine here is sounding this trumpet. You guys, I feel are aligning because. You know, you're on the spiritual journey, you're waiting at the door here, and your person is being enlightened. They, they completely see what's going on. I mean, you know, after all of these readings on YouTube and everything, don't question it anymore. I wouldn't. Um, I feel like this person totally knows that they turned their back on the wrong person. Whether they come forward or not, which I see them coming forward, Oh, they know. They know a person watching. They can see. Yep. What did I just say? What did I just say? Look, they want to reach out. That two of cups that they turn their back on, that's your connection. 
these two of cups right here the one where this person is stepping towards you reaching out to you ever so cautiously right because you're on the empress throne they're ashamed they're feeling embarrassed over their choices um i feel like this person really did try all they could with whatever they chose but it didn't work out and they're realizing it was all it was all about money I feel like it was all about money but you're the one that was all about the love sorry guys what's the split yeah they want to reverse this heartache this betrayal this third party situation I feel like is coming to an end for a lot of you now this reading isn't going to resonate with all of you okay um, so, you know, if it's not resonating with you, don't fret. Um, just take what does resonate and toss what doesn't or, you know, it's going to resonate with someone. Fool in reverse. They were a fool for not taking this leap of faith with you. I feel like that's what they're going to tell you. They were a fool for not taking this leap of faith with you. All right, you know, uh, they, you are starting a new journey. You're way ahead of them. Yeah, this person does feel ashamed and, and embarrassed. Yeah, now my deck's coming out in reverse here. Chariot in reverse, yeah. They didn't move fast enough. There was no forward movement. I feel like this person's just going to come to you and apologize. Yeah, sleepless nights. I feel like they can see um, all of your abundance here, right? Watch, they've watched your growth. They've seen all your growth here. They're realizing how far you've come. They may even, you know, this thing has cost them a lot of money wherever they've been. So they may be very low on their finances right now and you're out here doing really well, they could think that they don't have enough to offer you. Maybe that's why it's taking them so long to come forward. They want to reach out, but I feel like they feel inadequate in some way. Um, it could be about money, to be honest with you. They can't sleep at night over this. Deceptive energy, thieving, what is this all about? They could have had their money, like most of their money taken from someone, you know, by someone else. Yeah, they're, they're finding out about some kind of thievery here. And secrets regarding money and a business that they could have lost. Yeah, this has to do with their finances here. There could be this other person that they've been with, they could have gotten like a lot of money and possibly stole a lot of money here. This person's finding it out. They're finding out that they're shining the light on all the secrets. Anything that was, that's what I was just saying too a little bit ago. What was done in the dark needs to come to the light. Everything needs to come out, including these secrets. They, this person could have lost a business dealing with the Queen of Swords in reverse. That they were, um, that they were committed to. Could be dealing with. Um, an uh, earth sign. I've got Capricorn here. I'm feeling Virgo. Um, Aquarius, Gemini, Taurus. Yeah, now they know they should have chosen you, the one that they wanted the whole time. Because with you, they would have held the world in the palm of their hands. Now they're with somebody who um, was very clingy. See that bracket? That's like the one thing that I notice in this picture is a bracket. 
Um, but yeah, they, they were stuck or attached to this person. I feel like they were um, committed to this person. And this Queen of, Queen of Swords energy is, is not a good communicator. Very, very mean, cold, harsh, tricky. I feel like this person could have taken, stolen some money from your person. Whoever they were with. They had their money taken from them, this masculine energy. And now they know. They're, they're, they're shining the light on everything. All the secrets are coming out. Um, they're realizing who they should have chose this whole time, the one they had the passion for the whole time. Okay, give me one more and we'll wrap it up, right? One more card. I feel like this person wants to come towards you. They're going to tell you all of this. Yeah. Yeah, they feel completely ripped off. They were duped out of all their money. Everything that this person worked for. They may only end up with one pentacle. No justice. This person feels completely ripped off, totally hosed. Yeah, they they kind they lost everything. They could have lost a court case. And I, all of these pentacles here, all this that they've worked on, put effort into, right? They can't have it. They lost all of this. I think the only one that they can take with them is that, uh, is that pentacle. I feel like this person could have lost a court case or something. Or a business, they could have lost a business. Yeah, out in the cold, bad health. All right, let me get a different deck here. I just want to see if they're, what action are they taking towards you, you know? Yeah, they're, they're losing everything here because of this Queen of Swords energy. They really took them. This person feels totally duped. Totally. They were ripped off. I feel. That's what I'm seeing here. Okay, so what action is this person going to take towards my collective? Yeah, they're going to fight for this union. They're going to fight for this. They are. They're going to fight for this. They may have to fight against this Queen of Swords, but they want to fight for this union, for this reunion. They're going to fight for this person watching. Okay, well, anyway, that's what I've got for this reading. Um, I hope that helps. I hope it resonates with you. Um, if you like this video, please go ahead, click that like button, subscribe to my channel, help me grow, right? We're growing in 2022, guys. And until next time, my collective, take care of you and peace out.